The Aberyst with Cliff Railway, or Rhyfel the Greg in Welsh, is the second longest funicular railway in the United Kingdom. It runs for 778 feet, or 237 metres, from the base at the seafront in Aberystwyth up to the top of Constitution Hill. Only the Linton and Ninmouth Railway in Devon is longer. It was opened in 1896, having been designed by George Croydon Marx, later became Lord Marx. Passenger taken up the height 430 feet or 130 metres. There are an alternative route via footpath, with originally four bridges cutting across the railway. There was a necessity to remove 12,000 tonnes of stone to create a cutting deep enough to allow for the slope, which doesn't rise beyond 50% or 1 in 2. The railway is double track and has a gauge of 4 foot 8, which is just half an inch difference from the standard gauge railways that you find in the UK. The speed is generally about 4 mph. It was originally designed working on a water balance system, whereby each tank on top of the carriages carried about 4 tonnes of water. Water was pumped up to the top using a steam engine. So the upper tank provided the weight to pull the lower carriage up when its tank had been emptied, and then the reverse happened. In 1921, a powerful electric motor was installed. And the two carriages are joined together by a high tensile steel cable. The two carriages, Lord Geraint and Lord Marx, are of unique tilted design. They carry passengers up the top of Constitution Hill to what's known as the Lunar Park. Here there is the Consti Café or Restaurant, and also Camera Lucida and other attractions. The original ticket office survives at the base station. It's decorated with the Prince of Wales' three feathers, as well as the motto in German, Ich dien, meaning I serve. The upper station has been extensively renovated and improved. Generally, the railway is open between April to October, seven days a week. Trains can run up to once every 10 minutes. The rest of the year, it's open typically at weekends or on special occasions. <laughs> 